In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to maximize your FPS and lower your input delay in Fortnite. Hey guys, welcome back to another video of CDB and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to improve your FPS and reduce input delay. Now, I have compiled a lot of stuff and I think it will be really, really interesting for all of you PC players. Unfortunately, this isn't for console, but if you would like me to make a guide for console, because I do have a guide in mind, if you would like me to make one, please drop a like and comment that you would like me to make a console guide. Also, guys, please, if you do find this video helpful or just enjoy it in any way, please give it a subscribe and turn on notifications on because it really, really means well to me. And yeah, let's move on to the video. Okay, guys, so the first thing you guys want to do is to click the link in the description and it will take you to this Discord. This Discord is my Discord and it has many things. In this Discord, we... Uh, we just talk. I, I always reply to people. Uh, you can look for a group, self promo, and then you can also verify for custom games. Okay, but what you want to do for this is to go to NVIDIA control panel settings. So, as you can see here, if you don't know how to get to the con NVIDIA control panel, you need to right click on your desktop and go to the video control panel and there you go so once you're there it, this is the step-by-step -step guide right here but i'm just i'm gonna make videos on this just to explain so once you're there you want to press the home icon like uh this button here this should pop up and then you might make sure you have a version of 441.41 or higher I have 445.87 it's perfectly fine okay so now you want to go to 3d settings and then you need to copy all of these screenshots here so go from image sharpening all the way down to virtual reality pre-rendered frame frames <laughs> so yeah so let's do it i think I've, I've already done most of these so Move this over here a little bit more. This is how I recommend doing it, just making it smaller. So yeah, image sharpening. That can it's either sharpening off or scaling the sayboard or just off in general. I can't find just off to be honest. Uh yeah, ambient occlusion off, anastropic filtering off, anti-aliasing FXAA off, anti-aliasing gamma correction on. Anti-aliasing mode, application controlled. Anti-aliasing transparency off. CUDA GPUs or DSR factor factors off. Low latency mode on. So now we'll, we'll click on this one here. Max frame rate off. GT, uh, monitor technology, this can really be whatever whatever it is also would be good multi-frame sampled AA off just this one's for your GPU power management mode prefer maximum performance okay let's move on to the final one final screenshot preferred refresh rate highest available shader cache on texture filtering off texture filtering allow Texture filtering, highest performance. Texture filtering on. <laughs> Threaded optimization on. Triple buffering off. Vertical sync off. And pre and virtual reality pre rendered frames on. So, and then you just want to, once you're there, you just want to press apply in this corner here. So, that is the first step of today's video. The next step is to go to add, add where bytes here once again. And then you want to. I'm going to look for add where bytes. Be nice if I could find it. Here it is. This is malware bytes add where cleaner. Right here. So you, what you want to do is press scan now. Once it is scanned, it 
it will look for item detected you can see it has one item detected for me but i'm not gonna what you want to do is press quarantine i'm not gonna do it because i'm in the middle of a video but i will do it after the video so press cancel yep so once you've done the nvidia control panel settings and you've scanned your pc for adware you're completely done it's really simple and as you can see here i have nvidia inspector instructions here i will make a separate video on this by the way i then will make a quick cpu video but you can just have a look at it here and then i'll make a malware bytes video probably be in this video as well i will be adding more to this guys so if you guys want loads and loads of other fps tutorials make sure to join this and i will just show you how to get the best fps possible but yeah i just want to say thank you guys all for watching you make my day just by watching my videos and yeah i'll see you guys later goodbye goodbye guys mm.